Bards and I are finally here in Bangkok, Thailand. And the first order of business namin is shopping. shopping. Yeah. <laughs> Kasi konti lang yung dinala ko ng mga damit. Kasi I'm planning na dito ako bibili ng ibang mga outfits ko dito sa Bangkok. Ano ba papalaban ka dito? Ah? <laughs> we arrived at around 7 a.m. kanina, and since yung sa hotel is 2 p.m. pa kami mag check in. E may additional bayad pag early check in. So that's why we've decided na iwan yung gamit namin sa hotel and then shopping kami muna. at mag shopping. <laughs> Welcome to Platinum Mall, guys. It's giving me like an upgraded Divisoria vibes. Ganun yung aura niya. I love this. 20 baht lang siya. So, para siyang 40 pesos. It's so pretty. Pinibenta kaya ako ganito sa Pilas. Give me money. Time check. It's 3 p.m. Bangkok time. But 4 p.m. Manila time because Bangkok is behind for one hour. And it's what you can see. Finally, nakapag-check in na kami dito sa hotel. Tapos na din ako mag-shower. Sobrang pagod ko na. Gusto ko na talaga matulog, guys. Ngayon, si Bards is nag-shower siya. We're just gonna take a nap. Kasi sobrang inaantok na talaga ako. Kasi 5 a.m. yung flight namin kanina from Manila. Wala na talaga akong tulog. Kasi from date ni Ria, nag na ako. I did a surprise for Bards. Straight, straight na talaga siya. 1 a.m. na sa airport na kami. Kaya naman, sobrang down na talaga ng katawan ko ngayon. So, matutulog na lang muna kami. That's why for the Thailand requirements for our expenses kanina and a whole lot more, I'm going to update you later on. And don't mind the products na nilagay ko sa mukha ko kasi naiinis na ako sa pimples ko. <laughs> time check, guys. It is now 6.36 Bangkok time. Ngayon, is naglalakad kami ni Bards going to Siam Paragon. So, it's another mall na pupuntahan namin at kung magkakaroon ba ng damage, malalaman natin yun ulit later. So may shuttle service yung hotel papunta sa may Eskinita and then ikaw na bahala lumakad kung saan mo gustong pumunta ng mall. Nandito kami ngayon sa isang food place guys. Nakaka-overwhelm yung mga food nila and itatry namin. <laughs> Ang lakas ng ulan, hindi kami makaalis. Good morning guys! Today's day 2 here in Bangkok, Thailand. And as you promised, I'm going to give you the details about the travel requirements going here in Thailand and also about our accommodation here. Now, let's talk about the requirements in Thailand. You only have to secure two things guys. This is as of July 8, 2022. Okay, there might be changes in the long run but for the requirements as of July 8, 2022, ang kailangan mo lang secure is first of course your passport and second one is certificate of vaccine or negative antigen test or RT-PCR test result issued within 72 hours before your departure. Ayun lang yung dalawa isi-secure mo. Pipili ka lang kung meron ka ng certificate of vaccination. There's no need for you to secure an RT-PCR test. Pero kung wala ka pang certificate of vaccination, eh kailangan mo of course magpa-test. On how to secure the certificate of vaccination, ilalagay ko siya sa description box below. So yun lang, super easy lang. Now about our accommodation, nandito pala kami nagsistay sa Vince Hotel. They are located sa Pratunam. So for our accommodation, 7 days and 6 nights siya, I paid 6,090 Thai baht, including na the taxes and service charges. So probably mga 1,700 pesos per night. And the room is pretty big and sulit na siya for the 1,700 per night. For today's agenda is magta temple hopping kami. And look at our OOTD. Oh, the same color palette. Right now, nandito kami sa Wat Arun Temple. For the entrance fee, we paid 100 Thai baht. Each, we book a grab going here, guys, and we paid 214 Thai baht. Magti train sana kami para mas mura ka. So nga lang, it will take mga 59 minutes to go here. Kasi parang iikot pa ata yung train. So yun, nagrab na lang kami. Remember, nag shopping ako kahapon. So itong bag na bilis ako kahapon. So pretty and it goes well with my outfit. Bumaba na yung kulot ng hair ko kasi sobrang ini. <laughs> Next destination namin ni Bards is Wat Pho. So, makailang kami ng ferry. I think the ride was just 5 minutes, guys. The waiting time was longer than the ride itself. At binayad namin is 5 Thai baht. So, a total of 10 baht for the two of us. So, before we go to the next temple, kakain muna kami kasi sobrang gutom na namin. Another temple, another outfit. Oh, di ba? I changed na ako ng earrings, guys. That's the reason why I have two bags. 
this is the essential bag where I put all of the necessary things I need as I travel or explore a certain place and then the OOTD bag. Pero madami din ako nilagay dito. And for today's outfit or OOTD, ito yung isa sa mga nabili ko sa Platinum Mall. Anyway, we are here at Watt's Hole, guys. From where we took our brunch earlier, naglakad lang kami. I think it took us like 10 minutes to get here and then we paid 200 Thai baht each for the entrance fee. Now, it's time to explore another temple. At our back is the reclining Buddha. Nandun yung ulo niya. Tapos nandito yung paa niya. Sobrang laki talaga. Ang grabe. At umulan na naman. Hahaha. 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 Supposedly, guys, we will explore one more temple, and that's the Grand Palace. Unfortunately, dahil umuulan, hindi namin magagawa yun. So as an alternative, pupunta na lang kami sa Sayang Paragon. Kasi hindi namin napuntahan kagabi, kasi nga umuulan. Doon na lang kami pupunta ngayon, kasi may ito-check si Bard. Nag-grab taxi kami. Hello! Sawadi ka! Tinatakpan niya yung mata ko. Bawal daw ako tumingin doon! Alam niyo ba kung bakit ka? Doon lang, doon lang titingin. Walang titingin doon! Kasi may Sephora! Bards, pasok tayo. Sephora tayo, Bards. Hindi! Hali ka na! Hindi naman dito yung pupunta natin. Hali ka na! Dito tayo! Pwede ba tayo dito? Hindi, tamang idea to. Salamat sa ulan. We are here sa Sayang Paragon. Masyadong social yung mall na to guys. Hindi ako pwede mag-shopping dito kasi nandito yung Hermes. Louis Vuitton. decided to eat muna sa mga karinderia near the Grand Palace. Magsha-shopping kami ni Barnes <laughs> kasi bawal yung shorts niya sa Grand Palace. Kailangan naka-pants. Bawal daw. Ito. <laughs> bawal yung shorts niya. So, bibili kami ng pants for him. Bumibili po kami ng pants para kay Barnes. Ito din na to, Barnes. Ang laban na yan. We are now walking papunta sa entrance ng Grand Palace. And before I forget, we grabbed a taxi pala kami dito ni Bards and we paid 120 Thai baht. Mahaba-habang lakaran din siya dito sa Thailand. Kaya naman, wear your most comfortable footwear, okay? Very sexy though, guys. Thank you. Yung harap ako, yung crop top ko. Yung scarf pala, guys, dala ko to. Tinulungan niya lang ako to put it on. Kailangan daw namin ilagay to. May naguhubad po sa gilid ng karsada. We are done exploring the Grand Palace, guys. Sobrang laki ng place at sobrang init ng lugar. Hindi ako masyadong nakapag-film kasi bawal yung camera ko because of the external mic. So, kailangan ko tanggalin yung external mic. Kaya, hindi ako masyadong nakapag-vlog inside the Grand Palace. Kasi sobrang init. So, kailangan mo talagang mag-prepare ng tubig, ng umbrella. Ngayon, we are heading to Chatuchak! Nandito na kami sa Chato Chak. They're only open every weekend. Kaya naman perfect talaga for our Sunday itinerary at Chato Chak. May damage na ako guys. Did you pack the flashlight, the blanket, and the mat? It's a real adventure, the trail you're looking at. I'm glad you came for a while, I thought you might be bailing. 
Gabi guys, sobrang nakakapagod. Like, you need a whole day for you to explore Chato Chop. And, isa ko ito na pa ako. Para hindi kami maligaw dito sa Thailand, the download niya. Ano yan, Bart? Maps.me So, yun. Nagbibigay siya ng direction kung saan pupunta. Pero, applicable siya in every country, guys. Kasi ita-download mo siya kung saan country ka pupunta. Which is very helpful. Pupunta kami ni Bard sa Boxing Center kasi manunood kami ng Muay Thai. Gusto niyo manood ng Muay Thai? Okay, let's go! Tapos na pala yung Muay Thai guys or yung boxing. Oh. Hindi namin nabutan so babalik na lang kami ng hotel. After sa aming naudlot na Muay Thai na viewing sana is dumiretso kami sa hotel guys and right after nagbabalang kami ng gamit and then pumunta kami sa Platinum Mall para bumili ng mga pasalubong. Kasi tomorrow our flight going to Chiang Mai is early and yung pabalik na namin sa Bangkok, gabi na yung arrival namin sa Bangkok tapos kinabukasan yan early yung flight namin pa Manila. So there's no time na to buy pa sa lubong as we get back here sa Bangkok. So that's why ngayon na binili yung mga bagay-bagay na kailangan bilhin. And since gahol na kami sa oras, nag 7-11 na lang kami for our food, kain muna kami guys. And then we will pack after this and then tomorrow pupunta kami ng Chiang Mai. At of course isasama namin kayo. Day 7 here in Thailand guys and finally nakabalik na kami dito sa Bangkok and we arrived last night at around 11 p.m. Hindi na ako nakapag-vlog kasi pagod na kami ni Bard. And yes, both of us, we've decided na mag-extend dito sa Thailand for two more days kasi I'm gonna spend it shopping. Wow! Because I realized lahat ng mga shopping ko for the past days are mga outfits na susuotin ko dito sa Thailand. And si Bard's actually nagsabi sa akin noon, parang Bard's wala kang binili para sa susuotin mo sa Pilipinas. Sabi ko, ay oo nga no? And ngayon, nag-transfer kami ng hotel kasi fully booked na si Vince Hotel. We are currently here at Cubic Hotel. Sobrang lapit lang nito sa Vince Hotel. Naglakad lang kami ni Bard. Ayaw din namin mapalayo kasi mas mahihirapan kami with the transfer and all. Okay lang naman yung room, pero amenities and services like um, the staff and all, mas maganda pa rin talaga si Vince Hotel. Mas accommodating yung mga staff nila doon. Mas maganda yung amenities nila doon. Pwede pa pala si Vince Hotel. Kaso nga lang, same day booking, 2,400 Thai baht na siya guys. Sobrang mahal. So, because, no deal, no deal. So, I've realized na sobrang haba ng vlog na to if ever ikokombine ko si Bangkok na vlog at si Chiang Mai na vlog. So that's why I've decided to divide this vlog into two parts guys. So that's gonna be for the Bangkok vlog and a separate vlog for the Chiang Mai vlog. I am finally back in the Philippines guys is what you can see. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to vlog na about what happened to the days na nag-extend kami ni Bards. And umuwi na din si Bards sa Pampanga ngayon. So that's why ako na lang mag-isa. Well, going back, the reason why I wasn't able to vlog about what happened sa mga days na nag-extend kami ni Bards, we spent it shopping. So as much as possible, gusto namin maglakad-lakad na light lang yung dala-dala namin. And knowing my camera is a bit heavy, so that's why I decided na iwan na lang talaga sa hotel yung camera. But basically, all the things that I shared on the vlog, those are the highlights of our trip. A lot of you might ask kung bakit hindi kami nag floating market. Since it's one of the most famous activities in Bangkok, the reason why we did not push through with the floating market, it's because it's not the best time. Kasi I've read a lot of vlogs, I've seen a lot of vlogs, and maraming mga stores ang nag-close, so hindi mo din talaga ma-enjoy yung floating market around this time. Kasi nga, because of the pandemic, maraming mga stores na nag-close, so hindi mo din talaga appreciate so that's why I've decided to skip it I really enjoyed Bangkok I enjoy the food so much grabe yung food trip na mini Bards don and I did a separate vlog about our food trip in Bangkok so watch that soon about the stores kung saan kami nag shop ni Bards I will also make a separate vlog about it so this is gonna be like a travel vlog series to which I'm really excited to share it to you guys kasi feeling ko hindi enough na isasama ko lang sa isang buong vlog and Speaking of expenses, I'm going to show it to you now. Kung magkano yung nagastos namin ni Bards. Here it goes! And yes, that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope you find this vlog helpful. And I'll see you on the second episode of our Thailand series vlog. Bye!